Auction culture was not a clothing brand. Auction culture was a taste of freedom. Now, my next guest once spent their last 20 bucks to buy material to start what is now one of the biggest local clothing brands in the country. It's wonderful. When Lokshan Culture came out, it was around 1999. Lokshan Culture means it has a game. The first pair of Lokshan Culture, I'm going to dance. I love that so much, and I actually struggled to let it go. I remember one day and Chava coming to our high school selling red beanies. The bucket hat, which was powder blue, navy and white. Now you had cut out the lotion culture, you were just putting the C. Oh, I'm not. I was like, I'm on now. Fashion has always been a way of us expressing ourselves. It's a generation that was fighting to define themselves. Before lotion culture, there was no trail. Lotion culture made the trail. They're the first local brand that I would see dressing like TV presenters. Let's do it again next week, same time, same studio, 70 minutes! <laughs> and being on a music video, then appearing on Yizo Yizo. I've never seen young black people live like this. So that changed my life forever. We are producing good quality products that are expressing exactly what our culture is about. Everyone's always asking, where's Lokshan culture? It's not top of mind anymore. Yeah. Is there a specific reason why it went through the slump that it's going yeah. through? The rumor I heard was that it was sold to a Chinese company. You are in big trouble because people love the label and what are they doing? They are copying it. You have people on the street who are buying these labels from somewhere. They're coming in through customs or whatever it is, and they're flooding the streets. And all we could do is sit there and watch factories close. Sales has slowed down, and uh, our business was, was under threat. I'm a 2000. They don't know what Russian culture is, which makes it hard for it to be cool. We are definitely going through a renaissance period right now. Lokshan culture over the years has diversified and it's become like a broad brand. It's not only limited to Sowetans or to townships. Come with us now to the very first major catwalk show of Lokshan culture. We're not ready. We have to showcase but what I'm afraid of is what are people gonna say? When they, they started showcasing at SA Fashion Week, they lost the streets. Now, we may not have a lot of zebra skin on our clothes, but we're definitely African people making African clothing. Applause for style. It's never been about clothes, because 20 years later, we're still trying to convince retailers to stock Lockton culture in the sense that a local brand will work. We need to rewrite what the street represents. What it represents. It's wonderful! Getting emotional just talking about it.